हेलो स्टूडेंट्स आवर टॉपिक इज प्लानिंग वेन वी वॉन्ट टू एडॉप्ट एनी बिजनेस अ सर्टन कम इन आवर माइंड वाट टू डू एंड हाउ टू डू and this is done only by a pre-planned way so for a start the business planning is most important and first functions of business it is a fundamental managerial function and it implies an arrangement for doing something as considered in advance now herald kunj and O Daniel said about planning it is the function of a manager which involves the selection from among alternatives of observers policies procedures and programs it is thus decision making affecting the future course of an action of enterprise or a department now in conclusion we can say planning is deciding in advance what is to be done when where how and by whom it is to be done planning is deciding in advance what to do and how to do it involves setting objectives and developing appropriate courses of action to achieve the objectives now after discussion this we will see the importance of planning as we know without planning there would be nothing to organize no one to direct and no need to control so its importance is a bigger we will see one by one first one is planning provides directions yes it is planning planning provides a clear sense of directions to the activities of the organization it strengthens their confidence in understanding where the organization is heading and what for how best to make the organization move along the chosen path and when should they take what measures to achieve the goal of the organization planning reduces risk of uncertainties
you see a manager when he or she make a plan it is full proofed it is mention what to do and how to do there is much guarantee to succeed and achieving the goal so planning reduces the risks of uncertainty it encourages them to probe and cut through complexities and uncertainties of the environment and to gain control over the elements of change planning reduces overlapping and wasteful activities planning serves as the basis of coordination and activities and efforts of different divisions departments and individuals it helps in avoiding confusion and misunderstanding since planning ensures clarity in thought and action work is carried on as smoothly without interpretations so it is easier to detect inefficiencies and take corrective measures to deal with them planning promotes innovative ideas as we know planning is the first functions of management new ideas can take the shape of concern plans it is the most challenging activities for the management as it guides all future actions leading to growth and prosperity of the business now in this way many new ideas will emerge one after the other in the minds of the organizers by doing so he will become habituated to them he will always think to do something new and creative thus it is a happy situation for a company which is born through the medium of planning planning facilitates decision making planning tends to minimize the incidents of impulsive and arbitrary decisions and ad hoc actions
it injects a measure of discipline in a managerial thinking and organizational action it improves the quality of the organization to undertake calculated risks now planning establishes a standard for controlling planning involves setting of goals the entire managerial process is concerned with accomplishing predetermined goal through planning organizing staffing directing and controlling planning provides the goal of standard against which actual performance is measured 